So let's solve for the volume of a pen, pentag yeah, pentagonal prism. Um, it's not a pointy thing. It's got two bases. So volume is area of the base times the height. Well, our base is a hex times the height. The height is the height of the shape, which is otherwise known as the distance between the bases, perpendicular distance between the bases. That's our 15. We got to find the area of a hexagon. Pentagon. Why am I saying hexagon? I don't know. Penta. Area of a pentagon. Awesome. Uh, yeah, let's solve our penta. There we go. We know all the sides are six because six it's regular. Well, we solve it by doing triangles. We find the middle. We don't actually have to find the middle if we're not going to measure it. We're going to calculate things. Um, we're going to find the area of one triangle and then multiply it by five. So we need to find the area of this triangle that I've outlined in red with a height of green. Well, we can work with right triangles. So let's make a right triangle. Let's basically bisect that triangle. That makes this three. And let's see, this angle, since it's a pentagon, 360 divided by five equals 72 degrees. That's 72 degrees, which makes this angle 36 degrees. Remember, we bisected it. Awesome. We need to find that. So Katoa, sine is opposite over hypotenuse. Cosine is adjacent over hypotenuse. Tangent opposite over adjacent. We're standing at 36 at that corner. We got a 3 and an H. 3 is opposite. H is adjacent. So that makes tangent. Tangent 36 equals opposite. That's 3 over H. Cross multiply would be easy for some. So we got H tan 36 equals 3. Divide both sides by tangent 36. H equals 3 over tan 36. So H equals, I don't know, 3 divided by tangent 36. 4.13. 4.13. Awesome. We know that that H, 4.13. Now we're still trying to find the area of this pentagon. So we got one triangle. And so the area of one triangle is one half BH, one half the base. The length of our base is six. Height of our triangle is 4.13. We do that. And we get 12.39. That's not of two. 12.39. And we're going to multiply that by five because there are five of those triangles. 12.39 times five equals 61.95. That is our pentagon. 61.95 centimeters squared. So let's take that number back. Our penta is 61.95 centimeters squared. Multiply that by 15 centimeters because that's how far apart the bases are. Times 15 equals 929.25 centimeters cubed because I got a centimeter squared times a centimeter. That gets us cubed. You had to solve a pentagon. Or in other cases, it might be a hexagon, or it might be a trapezoid, or a septagon. I mean, you got to find the area of the base, one base. Uh, break things up into triangles. Um, that's the easiest way. Little trig involved. That's part of the reason we learned trig.
So there you go.